Post here bringing you with a brand new video today and today we're going to be talking about the new Necros card coming out of Maximum Crisis so today we're going to be talking about Ariel Priestess of Necros and she is a level 4 water type uh, psychic effect monster with 1000 attack and 1800 defense. You can only use the second effect of this card once per turn. Once per turn you can, uh, the first effect is once per turn you can reveal any number of Necros cards from your hand to your opponent and then until the end, uh, end of this turn increase or decrease the level of this card uh, by the number of cards shown. So you could, let's say you reveal uh, five cards, this card is level nine, you can make your Trishula. Um, if, if you reveal six cards, this card becomes level 10, you can make your Decisive Armor. If, this, if you just reveal two, this card becomes six you can, and you can summon Bryo or you can just reveal no cards and just summon Unicorn, um, which is the better, better one of the um, Four, I think. I think Unicorn is the best one out of all of them. Despite Trisha's effect being relatively powerful, uh, Unicorn's great uh, preventing your opponent from special summoning from the extra deck is even better. So, and the second effect is if this card is tributed by an effect, you could uh, you can add one Necros card from your deck to your hand, except a Ritual Monster. So, let's say you summon Unicorn with the Ritual spell. It's technically a tribute. So, <coughs> tribute by a card effect. So you could search out a um, Shurit or Dance Princess, or um, Archimage, I think his name is. <coughs> that doesn't leave you much room to use uh, use this card, but but it can search itself, so that's also another thing. You can search out herself. So, in the Necros deck, as it stands, will you be playing multiple cards? Will you be playing multiples of these? If we get sure to one, you probably might. You might. You might play two. Um, but I think you're probably going to stick this in the one of. Um, but like I said, we don't have Shurit. So it's really tough to tough to determine whether or not this card will be any good, uh, or if it'll be any dif different in the um, for Necros. Bonus side though is that they could probably they can make Bahamut Shark now, um, or can they? Can they not make Bahamut Shark? Is it just two water monsters? Or is it? No, I think I think I think you can make Bahamut Shark and then you can go into Totally Awesome. So that's pretty freaking stupid. You can make a Bahamut Shark and Totally Awesome in Necros and have Trishula. To take cards out of their hand in graveyard and field. So, anyway, guys, tell me what you guys think about this card in the comment section below. This card's okay, um, by the way. Uh, tell me what you guys think about this card in the comment section below. I will see you in the next video. This has been Team Metamorphosis signing off.